This is the entirety of my war band, Murphy's War. Uh, unfortunately, Murphy cannot be with us today. There's an horrible rumour going around that something horrible happened to him. I can neither confirm nor deny the rumour, but I can point you in the direction of 27 Minutes campaign on www.womenzone.tv, where uh, Murphy's War, Murphy himself, goes up against the Imperium. Also on TV is the Death of Hope campaign, which has been unlocked, so anyone can watch it for free. Uh, where I play against that other great orc war boss, say hi Paul, but he's not playing with his orcs, he's playing with his Eldar. So there are plenty of rumours about Murphy. Some say that Murphy's war is secretly controlled by an Eldar war boss. Others say that uh, Grugger Chugger's squig here is actually Murphy and whispers to Grugger Chugger late at night in his ear and tells him what to do. Some say that Dryland is a myth and so is Murphy. All we know for certain is that Murphy is particularly hard to find and uh, he's not here. One more thing before we get started, this army was gloriously painted to level 3 painting standard by Den of Imagination Painting Studios, link below right. Top 3 Orc units. In third place, boys, the backbone of an Orc list. Lots of choppy, lots of shooty, lots of boys. You need your boys. You get, um, they've got plenty of attacks each and you get 20 or more in a squad, they get an additional attack. If a weird boy puts Warpath on a unit, they get another attack. So if you get a boss knob in there with a power claw and 20 boys in a mob, but that'll be five attacks with that claw. That's brutal. Any Orc war boss out there knows that choppy, stabby, hungry, angry Orc boys are the backbone, are the best. And I need about twice as many of them. You need about 3,000 of them to have a proper war. In second place, knobs. Knobs are in second place because they're bigger than boys, which means they're better. They come in different flavors like the Mega Knobs, or swinging banners around all over the place. Or riding on the bikes. Knobs on bikes are good. But knobs. Knobs are bigger than boys. So they're better than boys. And in first place. War bosses. War bosses are the biggest. So they're the bestest. If you're doing fast speedy stuff. Then um, a speed boss on a war killer death trike. These are probably the best unit in the codex. And a speed boss is a boss. He's big. He's a war boss. He's bigger than the rest. They're mean. They're green. They have a secret. Which is they're always angry. Nothing can stand up to a war boss. Not little stompy things, not big stompy things, or really big stompy things, or really, really big stompy things. You can take them all on single-handed, no problem, without even breaking sweat. Do all sweat? Now, some person said that tank busters and the big mech with a shock attack gun should be on this list, but they've been taken out back and fed to squigs. So they're not on this list. Boys, knobs, war bosses, that's it. Thanks for listening. Happy wargaming.